Centennial makes their way onto the field with the kick return team. Again, Cole Beatty, one of the more dangerous players in Kern County in the return game. Is, is they have moved him up a line. We'll have to see if Stockdale notices that they have changed their defensive alignment, or I should say their return game alignment. Cole Beatty is in a, in not his normal spot, trying to mix it up. A pooch punt to the opposite side of Beatty. Fielded at the 31 yard line, hit pretty, pretty hard immediately, however, was able to spin off and make uh, his own move himself. I'm trying to get the number of the return man. Centennial will get pretty good field position from its own 39 yard line. And Centennial's offense is on the field. Come out in an I formation. Cesar De Leon under center. Giulietti and Robinson in the backfield. Brandon Robinson right up the middle. And there's nobody going to catch him. Brandon Robinson is gone. Wasn't touched. Touchdown Centennial. What a way to respond after getting a punt blocked and having your opponent score immediately. How about first play from scrimmage? I formation, mono e mono type play. Brandon Robinson back up the middle. Touchdown Centennial. That would be a 61 yard rush for six points. Kicker number nine for Centennial, Jacob Benjamin back out on the field. He was, he was limping a little earlier. Back out on the field to attempt the extra point. It is up and good. And we are now 7-7. Seven, seven. How quickly did that change? Two minutes and 14 seconds.